If you've ever wanted a beat face like the ladies of Drag Race, listen up. Welcome to Ms. Mojo, and today we're counting down our picks for the top 10 makeup tutorials from the queens of RuPaul's Drag Race. Before we begin, we publish new content every day, so be sure to subscribe to our channel and ring the bell to get notified about our latest videos. For this list, we're basing our picks based on several factors, including not only how fun the tutorial was, but also how enjoyable it was listening to them talk while getting ready. And I look forward to seeing you guys all on the road, all over the world, all over the country. Um, thank you so much. Peace out. Number 10. Manila Luzon I'm going to show you guys how to do a classic Manila Luzon look. I'm going to take you from this to this. <laughs> Manila Luzon may not have made it all the way on RuPaul's Drag Race All-Stars 4, but that doesn't mean we can't enjoy watching her get ready. Like the top commenter on this video said, seeing her seemingly boundless energy and positivity in this video makes us feel a little less bad about her not taking home the top prize. When I was going to go onto All-Stars 4, I thought, hmm, should I be like one of those girls that like gets her lips like done really big before she goes back on All-Stars? In the tutorial, Manila shows us some classic drag techniques like how to block out your brows and overline your lips, and ultimately creates a full face that is timeless glam. So this is a classic Manila look for when you want to look glamorous and crazy at the same time. Thanks for watching. I hope you learned something like what not to do. Number 9. Courtney Act. Watch as I go from this to this. This is a lot more than chapstick and mascara. While a lot of the Queens of Drag Race has offered their fans tutorials on their everyday drag looks, this video is specifically for a themed costume look. Courtney Act from season 6 of the show takes on a slutty stewardess look, but uses some popular drag tricks to get there. I think I might have learned this off Raja, actually, a video of hers. And I use that to basically carve out the negative space. Known as being one of the most polished queens, it's nice to see her in a more intimate environment, where she shares all her contouring techniques, impersonates Alaska, shades Bianca, and name drops Paris Hilton, who she actually made out with at a party. So this completes my Mile High Club slutty sorority girl Halloween inspired look. I mean, you would complete it by putting on as little clothing as possible, uh, getting white girl wasted and vomiting in your own hair. But that's why I've got a short hair on. Number eight, Ms. Cracker. I'm a woman! Maxwell Heller, aka Ms. Cracker, from season 10 of the show, released this video with Allure in 2018. Ms. Cracker, Shabbat Shablam. It's full of great advice on how to make your eyes look bigger and wider, and how to cover up any stubble you may have. Let's add dimension to my eyeballs by highlighting the foremost part of the eye. Shablam, she's highlighted. Hello. This video is one part makeup tutorial and one part motivational speech, as Ms. Cracker gives advice throughout that goes much further than your standard beauty tips. So do your makeup for yourself in a way that makes you happy, because real beauty is happiness. This queen's self-deprecating humor shines through the entire time, and we couldn't help but laugh at some of the deadpan comments she makes. If you're at home and you think you want to try drag, or if you've tried drag and you want to do better, let me tell you something. Don't think too hard. Just get out there and do it. Number 7. Raja Follow along and watch as I take this to this. Most people already know that Raja worked on America's Next Top Model as a makeup artist for years, so creating a flawless face was one of her specialties on Drag Race. This tutorial is for a specific look that Raja sported on the show during the cake-themed design challenge, which was definitely a fan favorite. She goes step by step explaining very clear how to achieve the look, using terminology that lets us know that she's a total pro. Really is an exclamation point, it's just one line down the center, and then right there. See? Your nose is just shouting at everyone forward, like, hey! Hey, look how fierce I am. Raja is just so darn likable that we'd happily watch a 15 minute video of her doing pretty much anything. I think I have achieved what I wanted. I wanted smoldering, I wanted dark, I wanted mysterious. Number 6. Sasha Velour Sasha Velour was one of the last queens standing in the ninth season of the show, and for good reason. So today you can watch me go from this to this. In this tutorial, she goes through her standard getting ready techniques, including how she applies foundation to her entire head. I paint a grid on my head, 
and then I fill it in. Everything she does is imbued with a certain artistry that lets us know she's doing so much more than just painting her face. Also, can we just say how soothing her voice is? Some commenters on this video even suggested she get into the ASMR game. We could listen to her for hours. And the beauty, monster, evil queen look is complete. Number 5. Detox For a red carpet appearance, Detox sported a look that she deemed 80s businesswoman, and in this video, she teaches us how to achieve it for ourselves. She claims to use old lady drag techniques, using powders more than cream products. A lot of girls do cream contouring. I don't. I'm like old school. I do my foundation and they use all powders for contouring. She clearly has a lot of fun with it, at one point even hitting herself in the face with a giant powder puff. One of the most refreshing things about her narration is how unabashedly confident she is throughout. We could all take a page out of her book. Oh my god, you guys. Look at me. Number 4. Pheromone Fan favorite drag queen Pheromone always looks pretty and feminine, so fans were anxiously awaiting a tutorial on how to achieve her look. So you guys get to watch me go from this to this. <laughs> While the end result is totally glam, Thera does claim that this is the simplified version of her routine that she does when she's in a hurry. Do y'all see that? Oh my god, look, no dark circles. It's like magic. If you want your mind truly blown on the effects of color correction, pay close attention to the part where Farrah covers up her 5 o'clock shadow. If you're looking for even more of Pheromone content, we also love the Sunset Talent Look tutorial on VH1's channel from late 2018. And we're gonna go from this to this. <laughs> Number 3. Violet Tchotchke This is another great example of one of a queen recreating a look that was popular during the show's run. In this case, Season 7 winner Violet Tchotchke teaches viewers how to achieve the fetish-inspired leather and lace look that she strutted down the runway in. While she goes step-by-step step giving tips on how to complete the final effect, she speaks candidly to the camera and comes off as totally relatable and down-to-earth. Her personality is soothing, and she manages to impart a ton of wisdom while making it all look so easy. Gorgeous. Number 2. Trixie Mattel this queen starts the video by introducing herself as legend, icon, and star Trixie Mattel. And that pretty much sums up her persona in about a second. Trixie created this video because she said she was seeing too many fans try to recreate her signature look and fail miserably. A lot of people dress up as me and then they're like, look, I was you! And I look at the picture and they look like a car crash. Throughout the entire tutorial, she shares the sass that has made her famous. And the final look she leads us to is completely over the top. Above all else, though, Trixie Mattel is absolutely hilarious, and you won't be able to make it through this video without laughing to yourself. I added some fun little bobbly plastic jewelry, some cheap little flowers in my hair, and um, we have all the essentials. Now when you go out, people are going to think you're me. Before we unveil our top pick, here are a few honorable mentions. I wanted to make sure that my hello to the world really was true to the Latrice Royale brand. Big hair and jewelry and stones and glitter. Look, this look is true to everything Alyssa Edwards is. Sassy, sexy, Elvis Presley inspired, all in one. Looks. 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 What does that spell? No. Number 1. Valentina Vogue's YouTube series, Beauty Secrets, showcases famous women, including models, musicians, and actresses, showing off how they achieve their everyday makeup. And in 2017, the series got the Drag Race treatment, when Valentina appeared on it to show how she gets fabulous. There were surprises from the start, when she easily wipes off her very realistic looking brows, and the fun continues as she teaches us how she creates her drag look, with some parts done off camera to preserve her real beauty secrets. There's no way this face is created in just 5 minutes, so you better expect that it's going to be sped up. If you're craving more Valentina, check out this other video she did with Logo. And like every good drag queen, I overdraw my lips, but not too much. Do you agree with our picks? Check out these other great clips from Ms. Mojo and be sure to subscribe and ring the bell to be notified about our latest videos.